hello guys welcome once again to my channel and you know it's always amazing to see you guys it's always amazing to you know talk to you guys because whenever that happens i know there is exchange of value i'm giving you guys value and you are also supporting us so um, i mean it's it's always a joy to come your way and i look forward to coming your way you know every day so guys um i have an amazing opportunity here today and um we discovered this opportunity just some few days ago actually because some of my team members you know had a chat with some africans i think some zimbabweans and nigerians who are already in the uk and they are already doing this job and you know after having the chat with them have after having the conversation with them we realized that this is an amazing opportunity actually that we can present to our subscribers or to our viewers for whoever is interested to explore you know now i mean we are looking at every way you know we don't leave any stone on 10 we want to explore every possible way for people to relocate to the country of their choice and when you get there then you will now be exposed to the opportunities in that country okay so before we move on you know we already have lots of um videos on employment just today we've released one amazing opportunity in finland and i believe finland is a great country you know if you have um a passport finland um, um finnish passport you can have, have access to over 193 countries as a matter of fact it's powerful than uk canada and us passports so guys the link is right up there after watching this video you can watch that video as well and see if it will benefit you we also have another one um in estonia which i believe will also be of great help so guys if you haven't come across those videos you can click on the link showing on your screen or you can go to our channel page to check them out and you know we are here because of you guys we want you to take advantage advantage of all any opportunity we present to you now today we are looking at nanny jobs in uk yeah nanny jobs i'm sure most of you have heard of the word nanny okay and i believe that we all play nannies in one way or the other okay either officially or unofficially we all you know perform the duties of nannies and as a matter of fact this is an official opening that you need to do and they will pay you and guys the salary is amazing if it's even higher than carers senior carers nurses midwives so i mean it's it's great i will take you through the salaries for you to guess for yourself okay so without wasting much time the outline for today we will be looking at who is a nanny who actually is a nanny we we'll also be looking at their roles or responsibilities of nannies when you come to the uk what is expected of you we we'll also look at some types of nanny roles available we will look at the requirements okay we we'll also look at the career progression if you come to the uk to serve as a nanny what are the you know prospects future prospects for you we also have a look at their salary requirements and some on job benefits okay we also have a look at some visa requirements what kind of visa you will need and most importantly we will have a look at some recruitment agencies so guys it's going to be amazing and therefore i want you to like the video please and please share the video and if you are visiting us for the first time please do all to subscribe and support us okay the more you like the more you share and subscribe the video gets to reach lots of people and we know that our work is being our goals have been achieved okay so please let's do that if you haven't done that yes just at the bottom of your screen please like the video yep and the same right bottom you can subscribe and after doing that the share button is also right down there please share to your friends you know 
families, whoever you think will, will, will benefit from this opportunity. Okay, all done. All right, thank you guys. So stay tuned and we'll be right back. And let's delve deeper into the opportunity for today. Now, who is a nanny? Who is a nanny? Now, guys, let me, you know, signal this caution. Before you decide to embark on this career of nannying, you need to ask yourself if this is the right opportunity for you. Because there have been instances where people come and because of the nature of the job they give up you know some run away and but this is a uk you cannot run away they will arrest you and you know you'll be deported okay so guys you need to peruse the opportunity very well read the job responsibilities and be convinced that it's for you before you pursue this opportunity we don't want a case or instances where you will come and you'll be fed up with the rules or responsibility and trust me the you know the salary is lucrative the on job benefits my god you can't believe it so we'll have a look at that in a minute now basically or simply a nanny means working in people's homes okay so if you're a nanny it means you are working in people's homes and you are providing care for their children whilst they are away or whilst they go to work so nanny means you are going to take care of kids of children okay and a kid is in one below the age of 18 so you are going to take care of kids and um when their parents have gone to work or have traveled or you know are away on business duties or you know errands that's your responsibility and some roles of the nannies you know some basic roles you know that runs throughout all nanny responsibilities are cooking meals helping the kids with their homework or assignments or you know having you know friendly educative chats with them helping with house chores or housework that's cleaning gardening and all that and also you know gardening is not bad you know just basic house chores related to the kids and also caring for younger children or babies that's you need to bath, bath, bath them or you need to teach them some basic skills as well and sometimes you need to be dropping the kids to school so these are some basic responsibilities of the nannies and also you need to plan fun games maybe you take them out you know to uh, play fields you take up you take them out to fun activities you know just to keep them entertained and because of the nature of the job most recruiters requires that you have a driving license okay so it's important that you have a driving license it's not mandatory you know but i mean it's a plus yeah if you have it it's a plus because you know um as we look at the job benefits you will realize that we will have a look at you know some live jobs as well you realize that they will some even give cars to you for free to use and they fool it and all that so if you have a license a driving license international license it's a plus and when you get to the uk they will work with you to get the uk licenses as well so guys basically those are the responsibilities of the nanny now we have several types of these nanny roles okay so we have live in and live out so those live in leave me live in means you are going to live with the family and the kids in their home okay so and i mean this one comes with lots of opportunities and benefits you don't pay for accommodation you don't pay for food you know they provide everything for you some even give you your own car to use okay just to take the kids around and all that to drop them to school and pick them up and all that so i mean basically your job is to look after the kids make sure they are happy make sure they are content and please it requires patience as i said earlier you need to ask yourself if this is the job for you 
okay we also have the leave out leave out means i mean you you go to their home after the end of your shift you go back to your own accommodation so meaning you'll be renting a place around where they live and all that okay and then um, extensively we have the after school nannies that's you come to the house when the kids have returned from school we have bilingual nannies that you speak multiple languages so you can interact with the kids we have full-time and part-time nannies okay we have holiday nannies that's when the parents go on holiday then you come in to look after the kids or they can go with you on holidays and whilst they go out to explore you stay at home with the kids we have temporary nannies we have weekend nannies you only work on weekends we have live in and live out nannies but most importantly if you are recruited from overseas to come most of the job roles are the live in nannies or the live out nannies those are more of what you'll be doing and in case your agency gives you a part-time that's um, maybe weekend nannies or you know after school nannies or then you you earn some extra cash now what are the requirements to be a nanny in the uk to be a nanny interestingly you don't need to have any requirement i mean you don't need to have any qualification yep you don't need any formal qualification however there are some courses that if you have taken them it will increase your prospects of getting employed and that is pediatric first aid qualification and there are a lot of online you know school, uh, online programs that you can have these courses done in a week or two that's pediatric first aid qualification which you will need to renew every three months and um, every three years that will be done in the uk and also you need to have safeguarding training safeguarding training okay you need to also have um dbs check i mean those ones will be done in the dbs will be done in the uk but the important ones are the pediatric first aid qualification and the safeguarding safeguarding because you'll be working with kids so you need to you know know the laws of safeguarding and the principles so that you don't commit yourself okay and most you know um parents prefer people with qualifications either high school or you know senior high school certificates or even age handy or diploma i mean it it gives them some assurance that you know what you're about it gives them some assurance that you know you possess some you know uh, good upbringing that you can live and take good care of their cats kids and you need to prove that you can speak english of course you are coming to uk so you need to speak english okay so you can either um prove with a test and i think they have a test for that or you can use the uk x test i have a video on that and that's the link up there you can check that one out as well now let's look at experience and qualifications as i earlier said like most jobs employers will look for a good mix of experience and qualifications but that doesn't mean that you can't get job if you don't have both if you don't have experience or qualification doesn't mean you won't get employed i mean but and let me it's important to point out that even if you've taken care of your kids it's an experience yep yeah? you've taken care of your kids you send them to school you cook for them you clean the house those are the things you'll be doing so all those are experience we don't need experience as in if you have been employed as a nanny before no experience what experience meaning that you've been exposed to the job responsibilities before and i believe i myself i was bathing my little kids you know uh, little brothers and sisters and i believe most of you have done that so you can put all those things on your cv and we'll be having a cv and you know cover letter you know coaching and mentorship session okay so please um as you can see the fly on your screen on the first of june at six british summer time so you just co you know just google it and see the time in your own country so guys this will even help you to put up a good and appealing cv and cover letter as i always say your cv and your cover letter gives the first impression about you because when sending your application you will not be there 
It's your CV and cover letter that will speak for you. So guys, this is an amazing opportunity. And then we will have a look at some recruitment agencies in a minute as well. So what is the career pathway? Now, if you come to the UK as a nanny, okay, with qualifications and experience, you can become a child minder. You can become a nursery officer or teaching assistant. And you know, UK, you know, those working on kids, working with kids, their salaries are, guys, are huge, okay? And a child minder is someone who take care of kids for two or more hours, okay? So you take care of multiple kids. So, I mean, that's a career progression for you. If you have an interest in developing your career, uh, in, you know, about kids, then this is a good um, role for you, okay? You might also work as an Ope. Ope means you travel with the family and you know most of the families that recruit nannies they travel a lot and if you get the opportunity you get the opportunity to travel with them and be taking care of their kids as well either in the country or overseas so i mean it comes with lots of opportunities and there are two types of visas which we'll be having a look in a minute now the salary requirement as you can see on your screen okay so um full-time leave out that's if you go you go in and you go and sleep in your own home you get an average salary of about three thousand four hundred to four thousand five hundred pounds per month you can tell for yourself okay and this varies okay depending on the location depending on the family the number of kids the coverage of your job responsibilities these salaries may change okay and a part-time you get about 1,800 to 2,250 pounds per month. Full-time living, you get about 2,400 to 4,500 pounds per month. So you can see all on your screen and it comes with lots of benefits. You get your own car, free food, free accommodation. Some even give you health insurance, cover and all that. So it's an amazing opportunity, I believe you guys, if you are for kids, me, I'm not for kids, so I wouldn't venture, okay? But if you think you have that skill, that gift for looking after kids, guys, don't waste your talent back home. Come on, take good, you make good use of this opportunity. Now, we have two types of visas. We have the domestic worker visa. Now, this vis visa is for those who are only coming into the country for six months or less. Then, to I mean, to serve as a nanny, then you apply for the domestic worker visa. After six months, you need to leave, okay? And you need to be at least 19 years for this kind of visa. And the second one is the skilled worker visa, which you will need a certificate of sponsorship from your employer, okay? And this is for people who live in the country for six months or more and you need to be 18 years to apply for this one and also your salary requirement as the uk has made some changes recently at first it used to be twenty six thousand, but now it's twenty nine thousand, and it will increase progressively up to about thirty eight thousand um salary requirement okay but as i said the nanny average salary is about forty five thousand pounds per year so meaning you meet and beat that requirement and interestingly if um you can actually travel with your dependents yeah if you're able to meet the salary requirement you can travel with your dependents and the english level is level b1 or higher so you can check this um the european framework b1 is very basic english just need to be able to speak and write good english and that's it for you as well so guys let's have a look at some recruitment agencies and um if you have and before i i move on if you think you are interested please just leave a comment i'm interested i'm interested just leave a comment i'm interested and if you are watching us for the first time please leave a comment i'm a first timer and i'm interested so that the team can you know follow up on you to monitor your progress i'm a first timer and i'm interested or if you have already subscribed you just write i'm interested so that we can keep track on you and please as i said just check the bottom of the video and like it for us yeah subscribe and share for us thank you now let's get to the screen and see some recruitment 
agencies okay guys so this is official uk government website so you will notice that then it's accepted in the uk so this is summer nanny as i gave you some types of nanny jobs so usually this wooden and i'm not sure they will recruit but all these you know vacancies are advertised by agencies so you just need to contact the agency okay and you can get it applied so we have afternoon nanny after yeah. So we have live in nanny by our Davis recruitment and the salary is almost 40,000 per year with accommodation. So you can see the benefits with, with accommodation, car on and off duty provided. Okay. And they have permanent full time on site only, meaning that you live with them. So let's have a look at this one. Okay. So posting they posted it just you know, a few days ago that the salary at additional salary information full time closing date is 7th of june on site so this is the company yeah so you just need to contact the company or you can apply for this job so you click on apply for this job now it will take you to the company website so guys i'm showing you how to look for the recruitment agencies so when you click on the job row it will take you to the recruitment agencies website then you can you know i mean contact them directly or you know apply for the job row and all that but first please read all this information okay to make sure you can do the job please me read all this job information don't just look at the salary and the benefits so these are the salary requirements and the benefits so please um and details for qualifications needed they said child care qualification preferred so guys you need to have some courses done online candidates must be a strong swimmer and hold up to the 12 hour pediatric first aid certificate as i earlier mentioned so guys if you are interested just do these courses online and then these are the details of the recruitment agents you can just contact them and you are good to go okay all right so i'll leave the link for to the government website so that you can use that to trace some of these companies okay you just click on it and you so this company is nanny's who nature agency yeah so you just need to target the agency and keep in touch with them so these are the agencies okay so now let's look at the next one the next one is read uk so at the what session these are filters you just type nanny you just leave the postcode blank and you search so this will also bring up nanny roles yeah nanny housekeeper so look at the salary four thousand five hundred per year okay and it's permanent and this is the agency okay so when you click on it it will take you to the agency it will take you to the agency and you just you know um so all these job roles are advertised by that agency so it's important you just google that agency and you keep in contact with them or you can just apply directly from this link as well the next one is corukits corukits okay this is also a recruitment agency um i'll leave the link there okay so you just look at the application process you look at the apex and benefit and their development for you the next one is nannies by bebo so this is also another recruitment agency and daily nanny in Bay Worcester. So you just need to um, look through and whichever you are interested or similarly, you cannot, I mean, if you, you can decide not to apply, but you can send your CV and your cover letter to the agency directly so that you can liaise with them directly and they will match you to the suitable job and this is another one any job.uk we have indeed.uk we have childcare all these are recruitment agencies okay guys because of time we cannot go through all yeah all these are recruitment agencies so i mean now the last you know there i added some recruitment agencies that recruit to other countries so when you check this one this is Riyadh. that's uae yeah? so if you are interested in going to other countries this company elite nanny company does that so i'll leave their link and you can check more on them 
okay so these are the visa requirements i'll just leave the link so that you can read more about the visa requirement and um this is another agency there's this agency yes royal nannies now this agency recruits to uh, saudi arabia as well okay and um i mean if you are interested sorry i said saudi arabia united arab emirates so as you can see five thousand pounds net salary meaning your take home salary is five thousand pounds per month okay and the location is jida and international travel that's european union plus south um usa you need to be english fluent as well so guys if you are interested in traveling to other countries aside the uk then you contact yeah. the royal nannies or the elite nanny yeah. company so guys uh, okay guys i'm sure you've all seen the amazing opportunity and the salaries are crazy i'm not for case i would have just you know quit my job and go for the nanny role i mean you don't no qualification and see you are making five thousand pounds a month my goodness with travel opportunities so all right guys so yeah we've shared the opportunity we've played our role so it's up to you to implement it so leave a comment i'm interested I will implement it if you're a first timer i'm a first timer i will implement it okay and if you need any guidance please don't hesitate to reach out to us we are here for you guys okay and don't forget our mentorship and coaching program on the first of june it's going to be amazing i mean your benefit is free of course and it's going to be on youtube so you are going to benefit we just want to equip you guys okay we don't just want our the opportunities to go waste we want you to benefit and some have already benefited some are benefiting okay finland and the estonia jobs most people have applied some have gotten feedback some are waiting for feedback and all that and please if you're a nurse or a health worker we are trying to you know get more countries so the video will be out soon so just relax and have patience some have already contacted us about the estonia you know registration and all that we are working on that as well so please just have patience with us you know it's tiring but we are here for you guys okay so please work on this now just leave a comment i will implement it don't forget to like the video subscribe the video share the video and let's get moving all right see you guys all soon and all the best for now.